when I was young at my school days. I was curious student so that my parent expected to be an engineer. But my role model was teacher also. I was a passionate table tennis player during my school days. I was an active table tennis player each year in middle school. I tried to make the school team each year. I failed to make the cut. By the time I entered high school, academic had taken over my life, grabbed my good time, day by day. Then see what happened with me. <sighs> I got scholarship for undergraduate. Studies for mathematics in USA. Suddenly, something struck in my mind. Reconnect with my long lost passion because there are a lot of opportunities. I was very excited about this as well. Hello, where are you? Okay, oh, come, 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 come first. Okay, okay. You left something in my apartment. I have sent it with my driver. Thanks. Okay, bye. Thank you. You too. I received a sealed envelope upon removing the racket. I saw a piece of paper from my old college directory stuck to its back cushion with tape. There was a phone number printed on it. Unable to remember why I posted the number on the back. I instinctively dialed it and was connected to a woman's voice. Hello, this is Student Activity Center. What can I do for you? Actually, actually, I want to ask you a question. Yes, please. Do you still condone discrimination? Excuse me? Don't you think I showed up at your table tennis club? I tried to play only to be excluded for a reason. I never fully understood. I faced 
डिस्क्रिमिनेशन भेरी बैड यू इन माई डे सॉरी टू हेयर दैट दैट एग्जैक्टली वॉट हैपन टू मी I set up a Facebook group called Kill the Private Club Hydra and invited Jennifer Chain the phone operator to be first member I immediately shared my story about the club then Jennifer did the same over the next three months several people joined all relating their stories of injustice at the hand of the private hydra the group swelled to 100 members with nearly 60 stories there is still no comment from the university authorities or the media on social media Rupam Roy this is Larry from university activities and government i was a strict parent i wanted the best for my children so that they could get admitted in good colleges my daughters did make it are ceos of fortune 500 but my son couldn't make it he committed suicide and since then i started this endowment so that i could give joy to the children and to tell them performance isn't everything but i was wrong i take full responsibility about this barber i shall put an end to all these brigands sorry mr rupo may i take this opportunity to ask you to join us as you fit our profile for a job in university and government sector of course if you have any other commitment i understand a few minutes ago as i started out through the window of my business class seat paid for by lerit's firm i held the passport in one hand and the table tennis racket in the other i gripped the racket like a pro and the passport really tight excited to pursue a cause i never knew i won't in a land i never imagined